members of District 51, I'm EJ. I'm from Achievers Toastmasters Club and YMCA Toastmasters Club Pune. In this term, I'm also taking up the role as a club retention chair for the Northern Region for the term 2020-2021. This is Lois. I'm the member of the Liquid Gold Advanced Toastmaster Club. And in this term, I am the club retention chair of Central Region. We are very grateful to CY for giving us the opportunities to take up the role as a club retention chair. And we are here today to share with you what are the roles of a club retention chair, which mainly comprises first, to recruit and train club coaches for clubs which have qualified for the club coach program. Second, to develop action plans with the club coaches to aid their assigned clubs. And lastly, to arrange for club coach credit opportunities for members of District 51. Being a club coach is not an easy assignment, but in last term, there are 19 club coaches who have their clubs to achieve the distinguished status or higher in the distinguished club program. So congratulations and job welcome. All of the 19 of you have received a certificate of accomplishment as well as a credit in your education program. I see that you have also been created as a club coach for McDermott KL Toastmasters Club. Can you share with us the biggest takeaway that you have gained from being a club coach? Thanks, Ejet. I'm really happy to serve as the club coach for McDermott KL Toastmasters. It's a great journey, seeing all the members growing from meeting to meeting, project to project, and it's so inspiring. And I also have a great time working with the EXCO team there to plan their meetings, especially the time when we have to transition from offline to online meetings on Zoom. And everything has been so smooth, so I truly appreciate their help and coordinations. And it's a great experience, reminds me that leadership is just like a marathon relay. The running part is not the most important, but the part when you're passing on the baton. And actually being a club coach is the final piece in my journey to distinguish Toastmaster. So I'm truly grateful to the club and also to all the district leaders who had supported and sponsored me to become a club coach. Wow, Louis, congratulations on achieving a Distinguished Toastmasters Award. And we thank you for your service to District 51. Well, fellow Toastmasters, Thank you for watching the first of the three part video brought together by the club retention team. And in the next two videos, we'll be having club coaches to share their takeaways from being a club coach. And we look forward to you being a club coach as well. See you then.